Morning guys, today I'm going to show you how to access and download your results from a um, career exploring website. So the first thing you're going to do is you come up to your search bar and you are going to go to mynextmove.org forward slash explore forward slash IP and then hit enter. And that'll take you to your ONET interest profiler. Then you're going to follow the directions and go on through. And you're going to click whether you like or dislike each item. I'm just going to click through very quickly. Just for clarification, I do not want you to click the same answer on every statement. I want you to read them. For example, operate a calculator. Would I really enjoy that? A little bit enjoy that? Meh not enjoy that or really not enjoy that. I kind of like it, so I'm gonna click on this one. It's not my favorite thing to do, but it's okay. There are 60 questions, and we would like you to read every sentence. Even if you are a slow reader, this whole survey, you should be able to do within an hour. It shouldn't take you any longer than an hour. Um, and hopefully we'll have, you some, have some class time for you to do that in. Um, but if not, you can take it at home on one of your virtual days. Okay, so once you've finished your surveys, you'll see this page. <clears throat> you want to go ahead and continue on. And this page we want you to print. So here you're going to go down to this print icon in the lower right hand corner and click print. Make sure you put your name right here. So I'm going to put Mrs. Bailey Price and click print. Now, on your computers, you won't be able to print. So what you're going to do is you're going to select on this destination section, you're going to select Save as PDF. And you want all pages and layout, and that's fine. Then, where it says ONET Interest Profiler, you're going to save the ONET part. But then I want you to write your name. Okay. Excellent. Now you're done with this page, so we can close that. Then we're going to go back to, back to our original results page and click Next. 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 At this point, you need to pick which job zone you want to work in. And this is how much you want to go to college after school. So after you graduate high school, do you not want to go to college? Don't go to Votech, nothing like that. Click one. If you want to go maybe for a couple years, maybe get an associate's degree or just go to Botech, you can click two. If you're okay with going to college for four years and getting a graduate or getting an undergrad degree, a bachelor's degree, job zone job, job zone three. If you want to go higher than that and get a master's degree, job zone four. And if you're interested in being like a lawyer or a doctor where you have to go to school for eight years or more, job zone five. Then it sorry, you're going to click next twice. And this is going to tell you all the different jobs that are available to you based on how long you want to go to school. You're going to click print here as well. And again, make sure your name's at the top. Print. Save as PDF. Save. On this section, I want you to delete interest profiler and minus at my next move, leave own it, leave career list, and then again, write your name. And click save. It should automatically save to your downloads folder. And once you're done with your survey here, this is the last thing you need to print. You're gonna go to your email inbox. And if you're not sure how to do that, if you open just a blank tab, There'll be this little waffle icon. Mine's not showing up here, probably because I go there so often. But either it'll show here or you'll see the little waffle icon up here and you can click on Gmail. I already have mine pulled up here. But you're going to compose a new email. And depending on who your teacher is, you're going to send it to either 